Hi, I'm Kevin Norman, on-air personality at WCCG 104.5 FM, published author, and your host for this week's episode of Fayetteville 180, presented by Cape Fear Valley Health. We're here at Riverside Bait and Tackle with Betty Kitchen, Cletus the Cancer Fighting Catfish, and a few of the Swamp Boys. Betty, I understand you have a tournament coming up soon. Tell me a little bit about that. Coming up the weekend, we have a tournament for um, that we've done for many years. It is a catfish tournament. Okay. It's right here at Campbellton Landing. The waters open up at 6, drop lines at 7, and then we come back on Sunday to do the weigh-in. Boats have to be in by 10 o'clock. We also give away a 14-foot aluminum John boat that day, too. Oh, well. Wow. And um, I hear that this is to benefit the children of St. Jude's Hospital? Sure. Every year for the past 11 years, we've done the St. Jude's Children's Hospital research. Uh, year to date, we've given them over a hundred and some thousand dollars. That's fantastic. Is it too late to register? Not at all. Sounds great. See you guys this Saturday at Campbellton Landing. We're here at the Cape Fear Botanical Garden with Angie Lindsay of Valley Auto World BMW and Nick Paris, one of the founders of the Fayetteville Wine Society. Nick, tell us a little bit about Fayetteville Uncorked. Uh, Fayetteville Uncorked is a social and charitable wine event that we hold every year. This year's beneficiary is the USO of North Carolina. We've got a, a, a lot of food from local restaurants that come in and, and provide hors d'oeuvres. We have wines from all over the world, and uh, we have a great uh, silent auction with a bunch of great items. We got a couple of uh, great guests. We have the uh, USO Show Troop, their international show troop, as well as Ryan Khalil, the center for the uh, Carolina Panthers football team. That sounds awesome. Angie, tell us when and where it's going to be. This Saturday at the beautiful Cape Fear Botanical Garden, VIP guests are welcome at 5 p.m. General admission will open at 6 p.m. For sponsorship opportunities and ticket information, please visit us at fayetteville-uncork.com. Sounds great. See you guys Saturday. In healthcare, we want to give more than we receive. We want to make a difference in someone's life, and we want to bring caring and healing to those that are in need. Let's get ready to rumble. We're here at Second Harvest Food Bank of Southeast North Carolina. I'm speaking with Jim Thomas, the food bank director, and we're having a food fight. No, 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 not that kind of food fight. We're having a competition where we have teams make dishes out of staple food bank ingredients. Think canned tuna, pop tarts, the opportunities are endless and it's gonna be very tasty. Okay, now who does this benefit, Jim? This is gonna benefit Second Harvest and the seven counties that we serve and the nearly 20,000 individuals each week that we're able to help. That sounds great, I'm actually excited right now. Where's it gonna be at? So it's gonna be this Thursday from five to nine at the Crown Ballroom. And you can find more information out at www.shfbfoodfight.com. I'm hungry already, Jim. See you guys Thursday. Well, we're out of time. But remember to visit Fay180.com for next Tuesday's episode, where we'll fill you in on more events in our community. I'm Kevin Norman, here at the beautiful Botanical Garden. Have a great week.